All right, so what is up everybody on YouTube? This is Bullet RC coming to you guys again with another tutorial. Now this one is going to be how to lace the KD7. This has been a very, very, very heavily requested video from Instagram to YouTube comments to people tweeting at me. KD7 lace tutorial. Drop the vid. Drop the vid. Drop the vid. Um, so yeah, I, this is going to be my take on it. I'm pretty sure other people have done this already as well. Um, as you guys can see, I think what really trips people up with the KD7 is just this space in between where it breaks from the hyperposite to the mesh. It's kind of like this weird long lace thing that goes on. And um, it took me a while. It's going to take you a little a little messing around with to get it the way you look, the way you want it to look. But once you know how you want it to look and you get the laces set up right, it, it's pretty simple. It's pretty easy. You just basically lacing them loosely. But anyways, you guys wanted the video, so here it is. So enjoy, and I hope this helps. Let's go ahead and hop into the tutorial. Okay, so getting into the actual tutorial, as you guys can see, this is basically what your final result is going to look like. Um, it's a really easy lace job. It just takes time to get it to the perfect point where you want to get it to. Um, just because the laces on the KD, like the lacing system is weird. Basically, the problems you're going to run into is just the strap. Make sure you make it a little loose like I did right here because... I think it just makes it really look uneven when you strap the strap all the way down. It makes this lace job look really uneven and this part just looks high and it gets really low and it gets high again. So definitely go ahead and loosen the strap up as well as basically the break in between the armor posit and then right here on the bottom of the shoe like I said before. It, it makes it kind of weird because usually you're used to just, just pulling it open. All the laces kind of set themselves. You're good. This one you have to go in and you know loosen them yourself. So I'm going to go ahead and start off with this kick over here. Because this one, as you can see, is still laced up. Now, first off, what you want to do is unlace them, of course. And then, usually the uh, KDs come factory laced up through this little uh, this little hole in the tongue right here. So basically, this hole in the tongue right here is what I'm talking about. So basically, what you want to do is just go ahead and un undo that. You don't you don't need that because um, this is gonna once again uneven your laces. It's not gonna look as good. So go ahead and do that. And then as soon as you get done, just go ahead, go ahead and throw them back through. Nothing crazy. And then you get this side over here, of course. Go back to the inside. I always like the outside laces to go over. So then once again, go ahead and take this one, pull it through here. And then go ahead and take this one and pull it through this side on the top. So basically, these laces aren't really going to move too much. And they're not going to be pull pulling out too much either. So basically, the length I usually keep mine at basically about right here on the top maybe a little bit shorter. So what I was talking about earlier is usually you used to just taking your shoes and popping them open like that, you know what I'm saying? Just pulling them open and they're automatically, basically they loose up, they loosen up and they look like you want to. But there's a break, this break in between here and right here in this mesh is where it's gonna mess you up at. So basically what you wanna do is go down here and just loosen up the laces as much as you want. Um, you know, all the way to the bottom. You don't have to get them, you know, perfect yet. But you want to just make them loose and you want to make sure you pull some lacing down to the bottom you know what i'm saying so here you go you guys can kind of see what i'm talking about so you want to pull some of that lacing down to the bottom as you can see right here now with this just like i do usually most of my shoes what you're going to do next once these laces are here on the top these right here your endings they're not really going to move so what you want to do is just take your hand kind of like put it all the way through and just pull the laces like that just so you make it even so what happens now is that your laces are going to even up and they're going to look even. See how you see it? You see how it's even, right? It's basically straight up, straight up and down. So here, once you do that, all you got to really do is go ahead and throw your strap over. And there you go. Now, you're going to probably look at this and say, uh, it's not, I don't know, it just seems like it looks a little off from this one. Like it's a little bit too high in some spots. And that's what I was talking about earlier. You're really going to have to like kind of go in and fine tune it yourself. Um, it takes me usually a little while to get it. It's just that this weird weird break right here um, where the strap is at So then you just once again go ahead. You can go ahead and pull it again um, And you just find you kind of just find the spot where you like it I mean if you just like it you want to just toss up there and you just like them loose like that like that's not bad That's not bad at all right there um, If you think ah, oh, maybe I got a little bit too much lacing down here If you wanted to you can pull these and I'll pull this one down Boom, put it back. Maybe you like it like this. It's basically just getting to the point where you can fine tune it yourself. And that's basically my tutorial on it. Not really too complex. It's just getting it to where you want it to be at rather than just throwing the laces in there some way and then you're not really liking it, licking a little off. So there you go. That's basically my lace tutorial on the KD7. 
um, if you want to lace them loosely, which is how I lace them. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Hope this helps. And um, yeah, I guess if you did your own little lacing tutorial video, you can leave it down below as well. But that is my method. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Please rate, slash, like, comment, subscribe. Hope this helps. If you haven't already, please go follow me on Instagram and Twitter at BulletRC. And um, yeah, if you liked the video, leave a like, share it up. You know, some other people might find this useful. I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Peace.